Can we get the match started, please? <laughs> we got King DDD. DDD against Rob. Oh, this is Rob. Wait. That's your too slow for real? He's not playing Rob. Is he really? Is this like a bad matchup for Sonic? There's no way. Yeah, I was going to say no way. Oh, okay, okay. Especially no way. With, with tag like that. Yeah, he's How a six. He actually has a good YouTube channel. You guys should check it out. What kind of content? Smash. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I knew you were, sorry, I knew you were gonna ask. This. You have to go to his channel to find out. He That's does fair. like okay. he, he had a couple of really good skits and like some also uh, informative stuff too. Got Look it. how he uses spin dash right into the homing attack too. Homing attack heavily buffed in this version. Sonics are trying to figure out how to use it. He's also very good at using that late hit of Nair. The mm. combo, especially against a big character like DDD, it's just gonna be really important to do. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense. I'll be sure to check it out. I bet I can just type in "You're Too Slow" YouTube, and something will come up. Yeah, maybe. I think he has a cool first name too. Like, I think his first name's like Sebastian or something like that. Oh, I see. I see. Like, like a crazy cool first name. That's crazy that he was just in that animation, and then you should just beat it out. At, <gasps> you just wait for it and punish. Mm -hmm. That is unfortunate for the DDs end. Oh God! Oh, and then the four, the the Sonic forward smash is actually so good because it's got that little lean back towards it, yep. and you can like space it pretty well in ledge trapping. The old hypno forward smash. You yeah. Know, why, look at my hand, and then boom, you're just gone. Yeah. Kinda Where'd like you a, go? Kind of like a sucker punch. Mm. Sonic's a jerk. Oh. And these throw combos are gonna be so brutal on a character like DDD. And that's like DDD. One thing about him too, in the disadvantage, his airspeed is so slow, and Sonic mm -hmm. just has so many different options to. Pound away at him as you're seeing these back airs, up airs, late air too. If he reads an air dodge or something, look at that. That's ridiculous. Yeah, back airs off stage in particular have been working out so well already in this, in this set. Hold up. Yeah, just really can't get anything started. No, it's just so hard. Nice jump out there. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he spin shot or something like that, but he had weird movement. It might have just been the way the neutral B interact with his jump. Right. Oh, and again, just changing the trajectory. So, <laughs> not even coming directly at him, so what are you going to do? Just mixing it up every single time. There we go. Wow, and then doing the up B to get out of there, this looks so difficult. Right, because if you spring out of that situation, yeah. how is DDD going to catch you on the other side of the stage? Like, right. he just can't. He's got that giant hammer. He's yeah. like, however heavy he is, it's not going to work out. Right. And on the flip side, if you do hit him with that, then all of a sudden you can get your combo started. Already getting up to 194. This is the second stock. Okay. Ooh, okay. Final. You had a good DI on that, though. Yeah. Right to the corner. Mm -hmm. Just not enough. Max Rage GDD up there. Yeah. Ooh! Oh, my God. The reach on the forward air. Mm -hmm. Very nice job, but you're too slow. Close out that stock. Yeah. You didn't want DDD to start to think that uh, he could make a comeback, you know? As as you thought, suddenly 50%. Ooh. Wow, what a, what what a see grab. That? He snagged him, dude. Yeah. Right out of the air. That was sick. Poor DDD, though. Like, yeah. The more I'm thinking about it, the more I'm like, that was a great grab, but God. DDD. Ooh. Trying to get Trixie with the, uh, the Gordo, trying to spit it back at Sonic. Wow, so that just kind of, the Gordo's getting beaten out. That's the yeah. second or third time I've seen that, where either he low profiles it with it and goes underneath the Gordo, yeah. or just straight up beat it, like in that last uh, that last exchange. Spin dash and spin charge just make Sonic into a moving hitbox. So That's you, crazy. So when you just have something like a Gordo that can be wow. challenged like that, and a, it's a huge part of DDD's neutral, so right. I think we're going to see in this game just like we did in Smash 4, this is a bad time. Not as bad as Smash 4, though, because in uh -huh. Smash 4, it was just like wet. What is DDD going to do? Right. Actually, I don't know if that's factual. Just conceptually, it seemed really bad but, Smash but, 4. But, but straight up, does Gordo just cannot beat Spin Dash? Or is it just no. like the... It just straight Dash up, is, not, no, it's not going to beat That's it. crazy. He Because you can hit Gordo's back end yeah. people, so it's like... If right, you're right, right. Rolling, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're just rolling. rolling. That's crazy. With how fast it is and how you can even combo off yeah. of it. That seems very difficult in the neutral. And DDD is so slow, so even if you do the, the sonic pressure where you're like charging a spin dash and you jump, yeah. and you just decide to bail out, what the hell is DDD going to do? Like, <laughs> yeah, God. that's rough. That's rough. Not good, mm -mm. but we're going to see. He's going to stick with it. I really respect it. Yeah. <laughs> I swear, dude, I'm wearing a shirt. <laughs> like, keep looking at myself. <laughs> I'm just wearing a hoodie. <laughs> Here we go. And also, Your Too Slow is doing a really good job as soon as he has like a good uh, understanding of when the spin dash is going. He starts approaching from the air, right? So just keeping keeping the DDD guessing. <laughs> and we don't have the speed to keep up with that. Oh my god, he's just stuck at shield there. Yeah, he was That's trying rough. to wait out like a spot dodge or something like that. Trying exactly. To catch him, but good shield work by Gossam here. Let the 
orange monster from Looney Tunes. Like Gossamer. Gossamer? Gossamer, isn't that his name? Am I, I mixing it up right now? I I, I, I don't know, maybe maybe <laughs> I don't know who I don't know. Gossamer? Off the ass. Yeah. Chat, you know what I'm talking about, the big orange monster. Looney Tunes, he wears shoes, that was it. Oh my gosh, I actually don't, I don't know this Looney Tunes. You don't I'm know so, that? I'm so I'll, sorry. I'll pull it up in a second. I'm so sorry. He's on like a lot of, uh, never mind, there we go. <laughs> Let's say like t-shirt, you know, like, like the, you know they did like, they'd wear like football jerseys and try to look tough. Oh, I you know, know what you're apparel? talking about yeah. now. Oh, the like oh. the fuzzy orange dude. There you go, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. He's just arms and fur right, 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 and, right, right. and sneakers, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. But anyway, yeah, I, know what you're talking I think about. that's what Gazimir is. Either way, he's uh, dropping a stock. Similar to how Gossamer would in the, the Looney Tunes. <laughs> Just unable to get a hit in. If no I remember correctly. Him. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, I, I see why he likes Kalos. He's trying to get... DDD, one of the best things about him is his ledge trapping with Gordos. Like, that's just an incredible thing that he has against right. most of the cast. Yeah. But you can't pin Sonic down at the ledge. He's just not going to let it happen. He's just going to bypass the ledge, go high, especially with the Kalos platforms there. So I think Gossamer was trying to do some more setups with Gordos at the ledge, but I don't know, man. Yeah, those those setups uh, are contingent on putting your opponent in disadvantage, and it just does not seem like that's really happening for you too slow. Well, that gets the KO. That's, that's something. It. Oh, yeah. Especially on a stage like Kalos, it's great to have that kind of KO potential. Yeah. This is very similar to game one where we saw You're Too Slow off to a big stock lead. Mm -hmm. Gossamir brings it back, and then You're Too Slow closes it out very quickly. Wow, nice. okay. That's good. That's very good. He had one jump in there that was really well-timed, just barely floating away from the, I think it was Spin Dash. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Spin Dash. Gossamir is also doing a really good job with his out-of-shield play uh, this game compared to the last one. Okay. Like, the timing where he's jumping out is, like, not being as punished as they previously were. And sometimes he even gets, like, a little baby punish out of it. Late Nair into up tilt. Nice. Trying to read the, the directional air dodge in. But said Gossamer went out. Oh, you just wow. Touch that? Okay. Yeah. Good for you. Usually you get, like, one mix-up when someone does that up on stage like that, right? But he just completely punished it. I just let it hit me. Out, yeah. of, out of respect for King D. I'm like, all right, yeah, right. you got it, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why not? Okay. There you go. So, yeah, instead of trying to, like, fight the Sonic when he's spin charging at you and doing all that stuff, spin dashing any of those, just a yeah. neutral B. It's just going to be a long-lasting grab, basically. Ooh, God. Right. And also the Gordas that he is throwing out are working a little bit better. He's not using yeah. it quite as much in game one as he was in game one. Mixing it up a Mixing bit. Mixing it up, exactly. But man, this looks rough. That looks so rough. It's definitely a tough one for DDD. It's funny because I feel like DDD mains, they got in this game and they're like, all right, you know what? Our character's not great, but at least Sonic's nerfed. At least Bayo's nerfed. At least Sheik is nerfed. Like all these characters that probably gave us problems in Smash 4. Yeah. Well, here we are. Still, there's, there's much, there are much fewer Sonics, but the ones that exist now, especially you're too slow, because he is a, he's a, one of those labby type of guys, spending a lot of time. Loves his character so much, wants to make it work out, and he's going to put the time in to uh, ensure that that happens. And he's not going to be losing uh, a very favorable matchup for his character like that. Right. So, I'm, man, I love his, his late nares are just so good. Mm -hmm. The way he was really coming good. off of that was very, very solid. Up tilt. Oh, dang. I looked yeah. off. He did the up tilt. Yeah. After the late nair, up tilt, tried to get the air dodge, but yeah. He showed a lot of combos, too. I mean, it's on DDD, so it's like kind of doesn't count. It's like comboing and, the same and bag. The, the soft resets, I think, in particular, were super good in his combos. Like the, the one grab he got off the platform. That was so sick. I wish we had instant replay. It's just yeah. a grab, but like it was so good. That, was that grab well, was raw. It was, <laughs> that grab went in. It really went in. It was crazy. <laughs> but dang, that was a, a little bit more of a decisive set than some of the sets we've seen so far. Yeah. Uh, the Bowser Jr. set was pretty quick, too. The best That's one. true. Actually, no, that was the most decisive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Chillager, yeah, because that one is like a horrible matchup, and the D2D kind of hung in there. Like, he did did what he could. Right. That's all we can really ask of him. Oh, we got yeah. Tweak playing on the other stream. Guys, make sure you're watching all the streams, by the way. I like to shout out all the streams. Yeah. All four streams. Yeah. Uh, maybe five. I think there's uh, maybe a rival stream over there. No, obviously, we got two two for ultimate. Is it two for melee? I think it's two for melee, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's at least got, one. It's, I think it's two, and then there's a stream over there. Was that N64? It was not 64 Oh, it might be 64. Point, yeah. It's Rivals or 64. Yep. So, so and there's a stream over here, actually. 64 is over here. So, you got like six. You got six streams. Check them all, man. I mean, hey. all the Smash games are sick. I was about to make yeah. a joke. <laughs> like if you, yeah, turn into the N64 stream if you're trying to take a nap. 
Uh, but wow, wow. N64, I love, wow. I, but I love N64. <laughs> I do, of course. How can you not love N64? The sets are a little bit long. It's our roots. It's where we it's all amazing. came from. Yeah. No, this was, that's why I was like, I'm not yeah, going to make the joke. But then I did because, like, you, you made the joke but not made the joke. But, like, yeah, right, because, yeah, yeah. I mean, I like ragging on everyone. Like, it's, just a, it's just, like, fun. You know, no, ragging I mean? is cool. Ragging is cool. Ultimate sucks. You know, like, whatever. Who cares? It doesn't suck. I whoa, love Ultimate, whoa, by the whoa. way. All right, let's reel it back a little bit. <laughs> all Smash games are amazing. Truly, yeah. they really are. I love watching yeah. all of them. And that's why Genesis is so fun. Genesis is a lot of fun. Walk around Genesis and watch a lot of fun. any Smash game you want to watch at a high, competent level. Just look around the room. And also, there's just, like, a bunch of other fighting games and arcades that are just out here. Yeah. Arcade machines that you can just play. So it's sick. Celebration sick. of gaming, as they say. Yeah. It is that. That's the most prestigious tournament. Is it? 